Kim from BizLamp Online and welcome to another free training course that I've put together for you. And this is a free training course all about Gmail. Now Gmail is a really great tool that you can use for free from Google. You will need a Google account. Now a lot of you may already use Gmail but I bet there are a lot of functions and features that operate in the back end of Gmail that you have no idea about. So this first video, what we're going to do is just take a bit of a tour of the Gmail interface. So when I start talking about other functions and features as this course progresses, you will be able to reference them in later videos. So first up, let's take a look at the search bar. Basically, the search bar helps you search for your Gmail account. Now further over here on the right is your actual Gmail account settings and profile information. Below that is the Gmail button, which enables you to switch between Gmail contacts and tasks. Up next is the action bar and this is where you can act on any selected email in your inbox. Over to the right is how to navigate through long pages of emails. You know as an example you might be looking at message one of 32 messages and if you want to get to the next page then you simply click this button. The gear icon is how you can access everything, all of your Gmail settings and how you can change your things. Now if we come down to the bottom left hand corner of the screen, this is where you can find your Google Talk chat status and all your contacts if you want to use instant messaging right within Google and if we continue on this is my folder and label pane this is where I can access any of my folders that I may have made and my labels and also any circles of people that I have in my Google circles I know that I'm currently in the inbox right now because it's red and over here is my main message pane which is in the middle of the screen. This is also where I can see my conversation threads and all my emails. Any email that um, you haven't read yet, so it is unread, is going to be in boldface type. Email that I have already looked at isn't in boldface. I can place check marks beside any emails and you'll notice that the action pane becomes that much larger. Larger, sorry. That is because I can now act on these emails. I can also start an email to mark it as a visual label. That I will go through later in the course and I can also click this button to train Google to what emails are important and what ones aren't. And again, I'll go through that feature of Gmail as we progress through this free course. So that's pretty much the Gmail interface and as we pr progress we will go through many more features that run in the back end. Thanks for listening and I'll see you over in video number two. See you there.